is Howard Akil Palmer. I'm from Atlanta, Georgia. My backstory, where I'm from and what I do, is that I was born in uh, uh, Portmore, Jamaica, 1980. I was born with a symptom or a syndrome called painting ductus aortis. It's like a correlation of the uh, aorta. And that was in the first week of my birth. Um, due to the problems, being a young baby just born, bones are fragile, um, they needed to go in there. So they couldn't go from the front. They went in from the back, moved my collarbone. And the problem is, is that the operation in 1980 in Jamaica at the time was not technologi technologically capable for the, the people there. So they had to fly in a, a doctor from England, and in that process of keeping me alive, I died. I was dead for about 10, 10 and a half seconds. <sighs> Howard Spencer was his name. He came back and he came in and he brought me back to life. I was born Sanja. Due to the operation, they changed my name to Howard. <sighs> when I was about three or four from the operation, I developed a major heart problem where I had to go back in for a second surgery. After the second surgery, it caused the left side of my body to not function, not move. I was enabled. They didn't think, especially from the first operation, they didn't think much was going to happen with me. Miraculously, I started going to the bathroom on my own, moving my hands on my own, walking on my own, following objects on my own. Miraculously. I came back, they called me the miracle baby. Ever since then, due to that result, I have a heart murmur and I can't be excessive in my movement and I can't be lazy, lazy. So I do parkour to, to live. I move to live. Uh, what I have going on in Georgia right now is PK by HP, along in support with Georgia Parkour, we look to, to establish the community, establish them in a, a form of love of, of movement. I think our generation or currently that it's too much in the home and in the video games. Nothing's wrong with that, but something's wrong with you not getting out more often than you should. Getting active, enjoying the environment, breathing. So PK by HP for the last year has been doing classes from beginning to intermediate, just getting people in, into moving, just enjoying it outside, go to major parks. I travel to every single, almost every single city in, in Georgia. And I meet everybody there and learn their style, learn what they're doing and just support them as best. Georgia Parkour is like a platform. Uh, you can look at it as an information booth or an information table. People can come to seek what they might want to learn about parkour, about the state community. PK by HB stands to bring those people in. Ask them if they want to learn, I'll come to you. Uh, you can come to me, Piedmont Park, anywhere. And we just get it. We get in, we have fun. We enjoy the love movement. We enjoy the fact that humans can move and what APK stands for, being a community community athlete, it's only right, it's only right. It's what I want, it's what I deserve. And I'm so blessed that Mark saw that and he felt that I was the one that he wanted to support that for him out of Georgia. And I stand here now with the utmost, the utmost respect, the utmost humility and with a stronger dedication. Now it all begins. The groundwork of getting people focused and understanding of what parkour is, not just death, actually love, love of movement, love of joy, love of, of being. You can be around the community and around your friends. And that's what it means to me. That's what it means to me to be a community expert, to be a community lover, to be a community athlete, someone that looks to help people grow, help people enjoy moving, help people enjoy mastering themselves. Because that's what, to me, parkour is about self-mastery. And I'm blessed, I'm thankful. Perspectives, life, I call love, it self mastery because that's what it feels yes. like. You, you learn one move you and then you, you link another move scars the back. and it's mastered. You, you learn to master it, and that no one can tell you that, no one can show you that. You can learn from someone to move, but how you internalize that, how you make that connection, nothing can compare to that. And, and parkour has anyone that I've ever met that's, that, that, that just is in love with it. They all speak the same way. They all understand that it's that that internal mastery, that love, that makes it so de so definitive and so understood when you meet someone that you've never met before. It's like you know each other. You see a guy do a move, you see a girl do a move, you like impressive. 
crazy impressive because, because you know what it takes to get that done. So the correlation is such, man. It, it's it's powerful. I'm Howard Palmer, and I'm APK.